Thank you. Yeah, uh, shot it well, obviously. Um, teammates did a really good job getting me the ball. And overall, we just I think we played with really great pace, uh, pace offensively, moving the ball. Um, usually we got stats. Uh, we have, I think we almost had, there they are. Right, we what do we you. have? I think 30 assists, 20, 20, what is it? I can't even find it. Assists, 27. So yeah, that's a lot of assists. I mean, Tristan had seven. I mean, that's, that's really good. So we were just sharing the ball really well tonight. Guys were making the extra pass for layups and wide open layups, wide open threes. And we were doing a really good job with that tonight. Yeah. Yep. I mean, I wasn't. I wasn't forcing them. I don't. I definitely have not shot that well um, in, ever in in one yeah, game for my life. So, uh, <laughs> but uh, maybe. No, I'm not gonna say. It. Never mind. Nine for nine. I know, not gonna happen. Maybe it will. Who knows? But yeah, yeah it shot well and it yeah, felt it felt really good. Felt really good. Sam, what a way to open one season. Mm -hmm. Eric gave numbers all the way around for everybody. What a great performance. Yeah. Yeah, it was a great it was a great performance. Guys came off the bench. Hunter had a really good game. Ty came in, and gave us some energy. It was just a good team effort. I mean, we, we said it was our home opener. We wanted to start off on the right foot. We don't want to lose at home at all. So we all came with a sense of urgency and had played a really good game. What was it like to be back on the home court? You guys were obviously out in Hawaii last weekend. Mm -hmm. Feel good to be back here in the Yeah. <laughs> I mean <laughs> it feels good from the basketball standpoint, but yeah, it feels good to be back home playing in front of our fans, you know, get some momentum going. We got another home game on Monday, so it should be good. Well, I was proud of the guys. They, uh, we had a quick turnaround after the trip from Hawaii, and uh, we did have one day off. Uh, this, the group that we played tonight was in Wichita, at Wichita State about six days ago, so they had some time to prepare and uh, they're a very good team, uh, a program that has been to the NCAA tournament three out of the last five years. And Coach Jones has won a lot of games. So uh, I was proud of the fact that our guys really came out and played well in the first half. Um, that was a very good defensive performance by our guys in the first half. And, uh, you know, Tyler Hagedorn, um, they had some matchups, matchup problems with him. Uh, their bigs had trouble getting out on the, on the floor with them, and then when they did switch the ball screens, we were able to take advantage of their mismatch, the mismatches. So, uh, just an overall really good offensive performance by Hags. That's a career high, eight for eight from the three. Um, and uh, I don't think I've had a player do that. Um, and uh, defensively, let down a little bit in the second half, but uh, when we got up 21. Maybe a little bit of, you know, we got to keep working on that, continuing the defensive uh, intensity. It is. I, I, was, I thought our senior backcourt, uh, Tyler Peterson, Tristan Simpson, and Cody Kelly, they had 14. They, this, this group pressures you, and they're quick. Um, and they had 14 assists, one turnover. Um, in that in that group, and so Tristan Simpson played uh, 34 minutes about, and he had one turnover the whole night. Uh, Cody Kelly didn't turn it over, and either did Tyler Peterson. And we ended up with, I think we had uh, 27 assists tonight, which is a great number. We're sharing the basketball. Yeah, 27 assists and 34 minutes field goal. That's, yep. that's pretty rare. Yeah, it is. We did a good job of moving the ball, and uh, you know we knew we were going to turn it over against them some. But 27 on 34 field goals is big time. Great way to open the home season, obviously. I mean, they've had these quick, quick turnarounds and this game on the road. But for that, what a great way, great way to break an unbeaten year. Yeah, great, uh, great way to, to, you know, for our crowd and students uh, to see our guys. Obviously, uh, Hag's first game, you know, back. Uh, he's he's got to be uh, thrilled to be back and, and play that well. And uh, it was great for our crowd and our fans and our students to see our team play well. And for Tyler Hagedorn, I mean, uh, is that matchup mismatch, is that something you're looking forward to trying to have uh, throughout the season where he's kind of just creating problems for opponents game in, game out? Yeah, he's, he's unique because he can, he's 6'9", 6'10", you know, and, and he can stretch the floor, so you got to go guard him. So if you've got a big that can't get out on the floor, and we saw that in Hawaii, you know, in three games where they had bigs that had trouble getting out on the, the floor with him. 
and obviously he shoots it really well. And he also puts it on the floor well. Uh, he drew a couple charges tonight or, you know, or, or charged into a couple guys or work on that. But, yeah, it's hard. Then they started to switch the ball screens because they didn't want to give up any pick and pops. And then we were able to pound it inside and he got some baskets that way. So we'll continue to work on that because when he goes against a big that has trouble out on the floor, he's, he's a tough matchup. It is, uh, and and that's a good, and we're going to continue to work on high low with them, and 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 because that's a that's a tough matchup, you know, when you get those guys going. Stan was was pretty good tonight. Um, he only had one rebound, that was disappointing. But you're right that when those guys are uh, going, it's a good combination. All right, thanks, Coach. Thanks. Appreciate it.